Mahalo! It's Paris from Epic Review Guys. Now, have you given any thought to what you're going to get your father for Father's Day? No, I didn't think so. Mother's Day, the schools are full of industrious kids making special projects that they take home to mom. But by the time Father's Day comes around, school's out, the kids are gone to camp, they're down at the pool all day. What does father get? A $5 tie? Well, for a few minutes of your time, and a few dollars more than that, I can show you some things that will make your father think you really gave it some thought. Now, Father's Day this year, I will be spending with my wife's very large family, very nice people, but when they invite you over, it's not for an hour or two, it's for the whole day. So run, save yourselves, there's no hope for me. But let me show you some inexpensive gifts that can make for a happy Father's Day for your dear old dad. And these are inexpensive, $25 or less for most. To start with, this is the favorite shirt of mine that I own. This is uh, from Macy's. I don't know that you can find this exact set of colors anymore, but it, they go for around $25. This uh, club room set of very bizarre and wild pattern shirts, which I love. If your father's 45 or older, he may go for this. If he's younger than that, I don't know that he's lost enough brain cells yet to love this kind of fashion. The other shirt is what I'm wearing. This is a Hawaiian polo shirt. Here's another one that uh, it's brand new, haven't even take the taken the tags off of it yet. These are from crazyshirts.com. They do ho more Hawaiian theme type shirts. The Hawaii, the new Hawaiian shirts, a little more formal looking than some of the older style ones. And the polo shirts, which are like golf shirts, you can get them for around $25 if you get them on sale on clearance. If your father would like something fun to wear out on the weekend, but not so informal that you can't go to a restaurant, you can still go to a fairly nice restaurant wearing this. Also, these shirts don't tuck in, so you don't have to worry about that, and they're very loose fitting. So if you don't know your father's exact size, you know, large pretty much covers quite a variety of size of person. Crazyshirts.com for this Hawaiian polo shirt and for a golf polo shirt that you can get in wild colors. You can go right to Macy's. You may not even have to order it online, but I'll put links to these both below this video. Now, Wild Shirts is honestly what I like to get. It's not what I give my own father. My father, books, but has to be the right books, and you have to know what your father's interested in reading. I know my father really likes war history. He likes anthropology and some different types of uh, science that is sort of explained more for the person who doesn't have a science background, so he loves learning about that. So what I'll do for that is I will go on Amazon, and I'll pick, like, military history, and then I will limit it. You can choose a filter that will say, show me only the books that have come out in the last 90 days or the last 30 days. The reason I do that is I don't want to buy him a book that he's already bought, and he's always buying books. So I try to catch a book that he, will, won't, he would really like, but he hasn't got a chance to go out and buy yet. And books, $20 or so, even if you include shipping for less than $25, you should be able to get a book that you think would be of interest to your father. It shows that you cared and put some thought into it, but you don't have to go stand in the store you can do it from your computer. Now for kids, books, clothes, boring, right? What do kids like? Kids like toys, but grown-ups don't like toys, right? You're wrong. Now your father may not admit to it, but just about all fathers I can think of deep down inside would love to play with a remote control helicopter or a, a pair of remote control cars where they can race their kid with it. Now they won't tell you that's what they want, but I bet if that's a gift that you got for them, that they would actually love playing with you with that toy. Now, I'll tell you a secret. Most dads, if they could do whatever they wanted to do, would take the minivan out of the driveway and go out and race other dads. They really would. You'd have dads racing up and down the street, which would be kind of cool, kind of sad, but kind of cool. But do you ever see that? No. Why? Because mom says you can't go racing the minivan. You know, Bobby's dad and I want to go racing the minivan. Is that okay? No, you got to be responsible. So a cheap remote control helicopter, a pair of remote control cars. Has to be a pair because it's a lot more fun to race them. That's a great gift idea, even though they'll be broken by the end of the day. But how many Father's Day gifts actually get used after the first day anyway? Or if you don't have any money, you can't get to the store, well, there are absolutely free things you can do as a gift on Father's Day. As my neighbor who I see out mowing his lawn across the street, I'm sure would agree, do a chore for your father, something that he would normally have to do. Go out and mow the lawn if you're old enough, so he doesn't have to on the weekend. Wash the car, do the taxes. One of those things that somehow fathers end up inheriting as their job once they get married. So do one of those things because that shows that you're willing to take some time that you have, that you would like to go and play your game on the computer, but you'll do that for him so he can have an hour to go do something he likes. 
And if all that fails, if you're five years old and you have no money and you can't cut the grass and you can't wash the car, what you do is you take a piece of paper and a crayon and on one side you make a nice picture and then on the inside you write, I love you dad, you're the best dad ever, because that's all any father really wants on Father's Day. Shopping is easy when you know what to buy. At Epic Review, guys, are gifts to try.